Welcome viewers. Today, um, we decided to go to Toys R Us since they're having like a, a big sale on all their toys. And we decided to check it out and see if they have anything we want. Because unfortunately, Toys R Us is going out of business. I'm so sad because Toys R Us is such an amazing place. And we get so much awesome stuff here. So there's the front Toys R Us and we will be heading in right now. There we are guys, here's just a quick look at the baby and child section, or small child section. You know, they have lots of sales. So yummy, here it is. Oh, there's Paw Patrol and Hatchmore. I'm gonna get red guy to look at that. And there's that Barbie. And here are more outdoor play equipment and stuff like that. So that's basically what's happening. And also we have some of the rows over there. Whatever those are. Stuff like that. So let's just see what's going on here. Uh, I have no clue what those are. Those are just scripting. But yeah, a bunch of stuff. So um, here's just a quick look at this place. Now this is the baby section. And as you can see, there's still a lot of baby stuff. But some of the nice stuff, the car seats and the gates over there. Uh, have been like almost completely sold out. As you can see, this is very, very empty and barren. Although I really do like the mama giraffe and the baby. I think it's so cute. But otherwise, you see it's very, very barren and desolate in the baby section. And also, I made it my mission to find the chalet horse. It was in the wrong aisle, so I made my mission to return it back to the chalet section. So I will be doing that when we get over there, and we're almost there. So. Just wanted to do a quick look at this, not nothing too interesting, but yeah, just in case if any of you want to. So here we are on the chalet and Playmobil Isle. So, um, as you can see, they have some Happy Train Dragon here, some Lake City, I guess, and they have some chalet. Oh, hey, look, there's a sort of friend. We are reuniting. Oh, crap. We are reuniting them. So, yay. Now we can be with its double or twin or whatever. So yeah, there you go, there's that aisle. Um, we have some coloring stuff here and here. Some baby stuff. Um, Calico Critters down there at the end of them. Some puzzles, dinosaur stuff, all sorts of that stuff down there. So that's basically what we're looking at right here. And you can see how barren some of it are. Well, not are, is. And yeah, like I said, see it all go. But it's totally awesome for us guys. It's an awesome deal! So here we go. Here we are at the little kids um, uh, entertainment center, I guess. Or not entertainment center, but it's where you can buy little uh, cars. Ooh, I want one of those. I want a baby car! And other little baby toys, I guess. Or child toys, or whatever. As you can see, there's some babies, up, baby dolls up there. And giant stuff out there. And, um,. Stuff over there. I've already been over there, and there's not really anything. We went over, and we, I found some good stuff. So at the end of this, I will show you um, cool stuff I found. I thought I got really, I thought I got some good stuff. I haven't really added up the price yet. I hope it's not too expensive, but everything is pretty cheap. Oh my gosh, look how cute those are! Wait, oh, there's the babies. They're so tiny. So yeah, then there's Cabbage Patch, For Real, uh, Boys Isle, there's Cars, oh, that's Cars. That has more Cars in it. So Cars, Cars, uh, Spooky Wimmy slash other stuff. Interesting baby in the right there. Um, just some Shopkins, Powerpuff, Nom Noms, those weird monkey fingerlings that are like, why would you want to put that on your finger because they're so big. And some tangles. Well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Then there's some Lena stuff. I don't watch that show because it looks a bit weird to me. So there's some weird fairy wand stuff. Barbie. As you can see, there's lots and lots of Barbie. Clean Barbie doll house. And whatever. Oh, it's worth that. I can't believe it. That and that. So there we go. Let's get a look at that. Barbie, Barbie, Barbie. 
Oh, I think I really have some more. Oh, also here at the mansion. Okay, so over here we have some interesting Barbie. There's a Statue of Liberty Barbie right there, so you guys can have a look at Lady Liberty. There's some Wrinkle and Time dolls. They actually did a pretty good job replicating that. It also kind of scared me. Oh, look, there's a Queen Bobby. Awesome. And here we have some Hatchimals. Lots of lots of lots of Hatchimals. They're amazing. And they are pretty cheap. Like the little blind packs for like a dollar seventy nine, and then those two packs or whatever for like two dollars or something. So I got a couple of those because they're a pretty good deal, and I'm really excited because I'll do I will be doing tour reviews on all the stuff I have. So you guys will want to look for those videos. Just a quick look around at this section of the store right here. And yeah, there we go. A little look at the Nintendo video game section right there. And check out over there and there's a girl doll right here. 50% all that. Wow, that's a pretty good deal. So there's a bunch of American girl dolls that are extremely the same costume, almost exactly the same. That's like army of dolls. That's so scary. And then there's more stuff, and books, and accessories, and stuff like that. Boxes, stuff to buy. Ooh, look at this little sleep bag. I'm riding that on the way home. <sighs> okay, probably not, but I'm just really tempted because it looks like I'm going to ride in a baby car. Yeah, there's no other stuff here. Oh, it's just more some stuff. All they have is the vehicles also. It's like this one. I mean, I don't play style on these, but I don't have to look at them. There's more of the pony stuff. More of this stuff, incredible stuff. Oh, like the Incredibles, like this movie, because all this stuff's incredible. Around, but yeah, so there's our with the Toys R Us. There's not too much left, kind of. Some action, uh, so in some sections there are lots, and others not so much. So it's kind of sad, but it was amazing to go around and just look around and get awesome stuff so uh-huh after we go through the checkout i will t i will let you guys see what we got in there we go um we have officially finished shopping and there's the outside to us again i'm so sad oh it's going out of business i'm so sad this is such a magical experience i've loved toys r us um, some of this stuff is not mine, like, we bought some stuff from my grandma since she wasn't here to give to, um, her grandchildren. This is, like, from my grandma right here. Um, here's some of the stuff I bought. I bought some Animal Jam and, uh, awesome deluxe puppy in my pocket right there. I put, like, kitty in my pocket, puppy in my pocket, and your ball in my pocket. And I've also bought some other cool stuff which I will show once I get home and, uh, I didn't have it all nice, so there's a lot of that was our last look at Toys R Us. I'm so sad, but this app was such a magical experience today. I saved so much money because of the awesome sale. So, I'm just going to ask goodbye to Toys R Us. Goodbye, Toys R Us. Thank you for all your wonderful, wonderful service to children and people that and keep them happy and giving them awesome stuff. So, thank you, Toys R Us. Goodbye. I'm going to miss you. Okay, uh, we are back from our Toys R Us trip, and here on the table is everything I bought. From Toys R Us. As you can see I got some pretty good loot. I got lots of Hatchimals because they were pretty cheap actually. Like normally this might be like five dollars or something like that but I got them for like a dollar and something cents. I can't remember but yeah so I got quite a few of Hatchimals. I got a little five pack. Uh, there's another Hatchimal here. Oops. So yeah I got a bunch of Hatchimals. I'll do a tour of you on it all those. I got this cute little three pack of um, Jurassic World dinosaurs. And it says there's like an exclusive one. On the back says the T-Rex is the exclusive one so we'll have to take a look at that later. Uh, I got some animal jam. I got that cute little animal jam monkey that comes with a little puppy. And I also got this awesome animal jam snow fort den that comes with a snow leopard. And I thought this was like, oh my goodness, this is so super cute. I got this for like $6, so I was like so happy. And then, I'm really proud of this. Um, these are the little uh, How to Train Your Dragon 
mystery dragon blind boxes and i've seen like another tour review on this and when i saw them i'm like oh my goodness i just fell in love with them because they're like tiny but they're like adorable tiny but i haven't opened these yet so i'll do a tour review on these and i'm like so super excited to see like what are in these and um, i believe these are all different but we will have to see when we open them and then as you see over here, I got a busy book, my, the My Little Pony movie busy book. I kind of like busy books, they're fun. I have other ones I'll do tour reviews on. So it comes with all those figures in there and a little play mat and a little book in the front. Oh wow, that was a lot. So um, yep, just comes with that right there. And then here is like one of the things, probably the thing I'm most proud of. This awesome, awesome, um, puppy in my pocket, kitty in my pocket, and jungle in my pocket, um, deluxe 30 piece play pack. So it comes with, um, 10 puppy in my pocket, 10 kitty in my pocket, and 10 jungle in my pocket. I'm so happy I found this. Like, I've never seen this before, and like, when I just saw it, I'm like, oh my goodness, I must have it. Because these are like all new figures for my collection, and I'm like, I just fell in love with them. They're amazing. So I will definitely do be doing a tour review on this one, and I'm so excited to open it. I love it so, so much, and it is only like $20, and it's usually like 40 so I just, it got a good deal. And I'm just like super, super excited on this one. I love this one right here. So anyway, that's um, all the awesome stuff I got from the Toys R Us sale. Um, this all all this kind of cost me like around maybe sixty one dollars, but on the receipt it said I saved fifty seven dollars. So that's pretty good because that's a lot of money you saved on all this. So it wasn't too bad. Yeah, I'm really happy of everything I got. It was a good last run at Toys R Us because I love Toys R Us and I'm so sad it's going out of business. I'm gonna miss you, Toys R Us. But thank you for giving me all this awesome stuff for like cheaper than it should normally is so thank you for the sale <laughs> and yep that's what basically all got so i'm very happy about that thanks for watching this video today viewers this is my first time doing something like this probably might be my last because toy r us is closing but it was fun to try to do it give you a little glimpse of toys r us and what it's like in there all the awesome stuff you got all those things on sale and uh, yep it was just really fun to Go in there and see it for the last time. So anyway, thanks for watching, viewers. Um, if you want, I have I do tour reviews. If you don't already know that, so you should check out those. I will be doing tour reviews on everything you see here today. Not in all one video, but other videos I will be doing other tour reviews of of these, and I've also done others of all sorts of things. So you should check those out. So, um, you're welcome to subscribe or leave comments or whatever. If not, just have fun checking out all my videos because I love making them. So, um, thank you for joining me today, viewers. See you around.